much. You're, you're a finalist. What? <laughs> so, hello, YouTube. I'm here with my big brother, Aaron, from So You Think You Can Dance. And he's a finalist. I'm a proud sister right now, guys. I'm so proud. Oh. He wore eyeliner, but I'm proud. Oh, so much eyeliner. <laughs> so I'm much unnecessary amounts of eyeliner. I know, but I'm so proud of you. Tell me everything about tonight. It was so amazing. I mean, I don't even know. To be honest with you, they kind of had me, my mind all twisted. I, I, I didn't think I was going to be fin uh, a finalist after everything that they said. You know, they were really hard on me today, as well as, you know, last week going into it. Like, even the packages that they showed, like me doing the jive, it wasn't very successful, and da 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 da, -da and then, you know, my, my, my mishap with Melanie and everything, like, leading up to it. Like, I literally thought that it was about to go home, and which, of course, I was okay with because I'm a huge fan of Fiction and Paul, but, you know, being the first day that was called, I was like, I, I can't wait to see my own reaction because I was so surprised. There was just, I mean, it's unbelievable. I mean, there's never been a tapper in the finale. Like, I don't even, I don't even know. I, uh, I, I'm sorry. I wish I had more words. I'm just, I'm so fortunate. You, uh, let's talk about your routines then. You had three routines tonight, which yeah. is crazy. You had a solo. Mm -hmm. You danced with Melody. Jasmine, uh, Jasmine which yeah. you guys need to get married. Just saying, and then you danced with Melanie. Broadway, yeah. yeah, because Jasmine's gonna be my sister-in-law. Have we already gone over this? Okay. <laughs> so tell me about your favorite routine tonight. I mean, you reunited with a gorgeous woman who was your partner, yeah. and you also got such an amazing all-star. Yeah, it was. Um, it's tough. It'd be really tough to choose. I've I've always looked forward to working with Melanie. I mean, because. I mean, I feel like I got so lucky with the all-stars that I got a chance to work with, like Catherine off the bat, then Chelsea Hightower, who's the best at what she does, and then Melanie, in my opinion, is one of the strongest, I would, probably the strongest female that's been on So You Think You Can Dance stage, technically, performance-wise. I mean, she is a beast. People call her a powerhouse, but she's so much more than a powerhouse. She is literally so beastly. She's never marking. She's like always so committed to, to everything that we do. and. It was such a pleasure working with her too. Like we got along so well, and she was so supportive. Um, so, to, I, I really, I was really looking, I was looking forward to doing the Broadway number the most, without question, because it was really good choreo. We really had, um, it was fun. Like it, and there was so much freedom. Like all the fighting that we were doing was all like improv. Like it changed every single time. So that was really fun. Um, but then with Jasmine, hey, I'll take, I'll take whatever door opens. <laughs> With He's an actor Jasmine. now, guys. Yeah, whatever. I'm just leaving right now. I'm going to go yeah. pursue my acting career. Yes. <laughs> but with Jasmine, it was so about the fact that we got a chance to dance together. And leading up to it, we figured that might be our, I mean, that could have been our last dance. So the fact that we had an opportunity to dance one more time together was, it added stress. It added stress. Like, we're backstage. We're like, oh, my gosh. Like, people are, people are going to be excited to hear that we're back dancing together again. Like, this is a huge deal. This is a huge deal to us. So we really had high expectations for the piece. We were very critical, even more than ever before. After working with All-Stars and everything, absolutely, it really changed elements of us working together. It did. And, and I think that that helped. It really helped us. It helped with the overall performance at the very end of the day. The thing is, I was crying in the room because I knew you guys were going to get through. You guys were in my predictions. Did you know that? I, I mean, I knew that you were that we were your predictions. I didn't know you were psychic. I mean, I, I mean, you know, it's a new talent. I mean, I'm Sabrina the Teenage Witch now, guys. Totally I'm right. blonde. Sabrina the Teenage Witch. Yes. You got it all. And then, I, I, what would you be on our show then? What would you be on that show? Didn't Sabrina have like a cat that talked? I, like, Can I be him? I'd like to be the voice of that cat. How about, how about this? We bring in a big brother to the show. Okay. No one knows. Okay. And then we'll just be like, he was on the show all along. What's my ability? I don't want to be psychic like you. I want to be something else. You can be, so you can be the dancer. The dancer? <laughs> I'm kidding. No, no, no. No, how about you control what people think? That's pretty cool. I'm totally down for that. Okay, well, guys, catch us on the MTV reruns. And catch him <laughs> next MTV week. Two, late night. Yes. <laughs> and catch and catch him next week on So You Think You Can Dance. All right, guys, the family's going to go eat dinner now. Jasmine, <laughs> yeah, yeah. we'll see you at dinner. Bye. <laughs>